Do you hear that? That is the sound of nothingness or peace and tranquility. Iowa is not a life in the fast lane type of lifestyle. That does not mean there is nothing to do here in Iowa, but we are not on top of each other and you can find a place that you can have your independence. That is why we love it, but there is more to go over than that as Iowa has a certain lifestyle that is unique. In this video, I will paint the picture of what you can expect if you plan on calling America's heartland your next home. Let's start with sports. Iowa has two major sports teams in the University of Iowa and Iowa State University. Believe it or not, the rivalry is crazy and Iowans go a little too far with it, especially Iowa fans. Sorry, Iowa fans, but it is true. If you are moving to Iowa, either become a fan of Iowa or expect to be surrounded by Iowa fans. Iowa nice. You can't talk about Iowa without mentioning the people. Iowa nice is something most Iowans take pride in and is true for the most part. We asked our past clients what they like most about Iowa and every single one of them mentioned the people and how nice they are. People hold the door open, say hi, wave back at you and are courteous to each other. In fact, I had clients in town touring the area as they plan on buying soon and we were at a local coffee shop. There were two ladies holding the door open for a vendor to come in with a dolly full of supplies. They pointed it out to me and said, we can't wait to be in Iowa as the people are the best. If you are watching this and are planning on buying, selling, or investing in Iowa, give us a call, shoot us a text, or send us an email as we would absolutely love to explain how us at the Living in Iowa team can be the greatest asset to your situation. We look forward to hearing from you. Weather resilient. To adopt the Iowa lifestyle, you must be tough and mentally prepared. Iowa gets cold winters with sub-zero temperatures likely in the coldest months of the year, which are typically January and February. It can be downright frigid with severe wind chills and blizzard potential. The spring can bring forward potential tornadoes, severe thunderstorms, and flooding. Tornadoes are possible but many times you have plenty of warning to prepare. If severe weather is a potential, make sure to be on top of the warnings that can come with severe weather. Flooding is another potential, but like tornadoes, you typically have time to react if you are paying attention. Now, summer has potential for flooding, severe thunderstorms and tornadoes as well. The most common complaint for many is the hot and humid weather the summer brings here in Iowa. We may not get as hot as in the southern part of the United States, but we are consistently one of the most humid states and summer is the most uncomfortable part of the humidity. Many say it is from all the corn grown in the state, but let's put it this way. You need air conditioning, not just for the heat in the summer, but to keep your home from being a humid hot box. Fall has potential for severe weather as well, but it's typically the least volatile. That being said, all four seasons are volatile. And one thing you learn to live with is that the weather can be mild one day and can be taken to the extreme the next. You must be resilient to live here. If you are watching this and learning more about Iowa, please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and hit that bell so you are notified on all things living in Iowa each and every week. Farming. Iowa is one of the top agricultural states in the US, if not the top. We are consistently the top state for corn and soybeans in the US, hence the term corn fed being a slogan of our state. The ironic thing about the corn fed saying is that you can't go out in a cornfield in Iowa and eat the corn off the stock as is GMO and mostly for feed for livestock and high fructose corn syrup production. Iowa has a great climate as the humidity works to the farmer's advantage. With humid weather and fertile soil, there is not a better place to not only farm, but homestead. We did a video on homesteading that we'll link above. Make sure to check that out after you finish this video. Affordability. Iowans love living here because of good jobs and affordable housing and living. Now we did a video that went deep into cost of living in Iowa and did a thorough explanation of it in a past video, 
But all in all, Iowa housing is way below the national average and home ownership is not going away like some other states with high housing costs. Iowans are also the type of people that like to do many things themselves instead of hire a professional. Whether that is put in their own fencing, remodel their home themselves, grow their own produce, put in their own concrete, sell their home themselves, the list goes on and on. Overall, Iowa has great people that are more self-sufficient than many other states, and that is a trend that is really taking off more than ever here in Iowa. Political trend. Iowa was for many years considered a swing state and went back and forth between a Democratic leading state and a Republican state. After COVID, the state turned into a red state from all the craziness that happened during that time frame. Now, Iowa is getting more and more red by the day. It really seems that way. Many people that have reached out to me tell me what is going on in their state and how excited they are about getting to Iowa so they can live and let live more than they have been in recent years. With more and more people looking to move from a blue state to a red state, I don't think it will slow down anytime soon. Peace and tranquility. In Iowa, the people are great. Politics and more live and let live. And with all that seems like another huge advantage Iowa has compared to other states is its slower paced lifestyle. One of the things we love about living here is that the peace and tranquility. Even though we have neighbors, we can go in our backyard and just relax. Iowa people tend to stay out of your business as long as you don't cause them any problems. Now, if you're the type that wants to get along with your neighbors, wants to conversate with them, you can definitely do that, but you can also have your independence. You can have it your way in Iowa.